Hey guys, what's up? Today I um, wanted to try something new. Um, I'm testing out the new Sigma 10 to 18 mil lens and I thought it would be fun to kind of show you what it looks like, how to use it, the experience I've had with it and just give you some ideas if you, this is something you'd be interested in buying for yourself. Um, this lens is for an APS-C crop camera, um, but I'm using it on my full frame Sony a 7 IV. Today I am in downtown Boise, so the first spot is the Capitol building. You can see behind me, um, I'll be doing a hyperlapse. Um, I wanted to use this wide angle to see how much of the frame I can get creating a hyperlapse with uh, with this lens. Um, I wanted to just show you the lens a little bit so you can see it's on 18 mil right now and if I switch it to 10 it's only a small adjustment so the the actual lens isn't moving out as much which is nice. Um, I am going to shoot in 10 I think since it is a 1.5 so it'll actually be 15 um, mils um, and you can see it's quite a wide angle so what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk along here and get a couple of shots, make a hyperlapse and hopefully it turns out good. So we are inside the capsule building um, and I want to test out how well this lens does in, uh, inside of a building. Yeah, I'm hoping to get some cool shots of this building. There's a lot of architectural beauty in here. So I'm going to see if I can try and create some kind of concept uh, with a hyperlapse in mind and see what I get. So yeah, stay tuned. This is amazing. Hey guys, okay, I am testing the lens out, uh, walking. Um, I'm doing it handheld. Uh, it is on 18 mil, obviously with the APS-C crop. So, uh, you know, it'll be 27 mil, but so far it's pretty wide. I don't have to stretch my arm out too close. Like I can get really close or you know, super far. And if I zoom out, uh, hold on like you get a pretty decent view of me uh, so you can do a lot with this lens if you wanted something lighter this would actually be really good uh, for vlogging obviously the distortion on your face will be a little bit different but yeah I mean it's really great get the view at the back and then if I zoom in you know the focus is more on me so so far so good i'm actually really impressed with how this lens is uh working okay we are at the boise fry company we are stopping to get some burgers before getting to the next location uh so i thought i'd just show you the 
seating. Uh, we were just waiting for our food and then hopefully we'll be doing a few more time lapses as well, testing out the stands. Really enjoying how light this is because it really helps when you're trying to vlog and you don't have such a heavy lens to fork it, you know, so. So our next location, we are in a Freak Alley. Uh, it's basically just like an alleyway that's filled with different types of art and graffiti. So I really love that the cut, there's like an interesting color concept around here. So I want to try and use this wide angle lens to see what kind of shots I get. And hopefully we get some cool shots. Uh, let's see. 